I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos with this 5 foot 10 Kawai. I have worked on so, so many Kawais over the years. They, they actually uh, are the, the piano that is used in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. And for about 12 years or so of my piano career from about 2000 to 2012, I serviced all of the pianos um, in about, uh, what was it, maybe 30 or so churches, and they were all Kauai, so I'm very, very familiar with Kauai in general and this model in particular. A lot of them were this model. This is a great model. This is the model that's used in the uh, in the main um, in the main chapel. Um, what is it? About 300 seats or so. So it fills even even a piano this size, five foot ten, actually can can fill a, a 300 seat room just fine. Um, but that said, it's also, frankly, about, in my opinion, about the ideal size piano for a living room. You don't have to have, you don't have to have a concert grand to fill a 300 seat, and you don't have to have a small piano in order to, really small piano in order to feel, um, uh, so you don't feel overwhelmed in a living room. 5 foot 10 is the ideal. Not, not too big, like, like maybe that piano right there, that giant 9 foot piano, although I actually have a nine-foot piano in my living room. So the bigger the better, frankly. And we have a five-two. And then, and then we have another one, yeah. Very dense so uh, yeah, this, this piano, 1978 was when it was originally manufactured, and we've, we've gone through it both inside and outside. It's in near perfect condition, nearly mint condition after everything that we've done to it. Pianos have about 20 to 25 years of, of, really, of really good use, and, and af after that, they, they need to be refurbished. Our list is so uh, exhaustive, what we do to our pianos, that, uh, that, that it's virtually brand new when we're, when we're done with it. Of course, on really old pianos, like 100-year-old pianos, we're going to basically replace everything. But on something like this, it was, it was in pretty good condition when we got it. And then after the refurbishing, you know, reshaping hammers and alignment and regulation and everything like that, they, uh, they really clean up, clean up very, very well with our, with our system. And then on the outside, why don't you get some shots of the outside? I would give it, I would give it uh, an A, bordering on A plus, not quite A plus, but pretty darn close to A plus. Just a beautiful, beautiful piano. I think uh, if you if you had this piano in in your living room. Um, It'd be hard hard to tell, frankly, that it's not brand new, and and price wise, price wise, we're we're about what a third approximately of what this piano would be brand new. So I think I think that's why I'll, I'll throw this in there and then I'll and then I'll play it real quick. I think that's why we've been so successful at selling these these refurbished pianos. A lot of them, a lot of these pianos that we have in the in the in the shop now are brand new. But a lot of them are this refurbished, a lot of Kawais and, and um, Yamahas, what we do, Pramberger, Young Chang, lots of different Steinways, a couple Mason Hamlins, Samick, lots of different brands that are, that are refurbished. But I think we've been so successful because we, we are, and you'll see if you come play this piano, we are so good at what we do in, in returning these pianos pretty close to brand new. And that, that uh, not only the way they, they feel, but also the way they sound. And, and finally, and just as important as the other two, but maybe it's somewhat overlooked in how they will endure. These pianos, I've, I've been doing this for, for decades now, and they endure like a brand new piano. I can say that from uh, actually having experience um, over the years servicing these pianos after, after people purchase them from me. So they endure. Uh, basically like a brand new piano, and yet they're, they're a fraction of what it costs brand new. So I think that uh, seems like a, a reasonable enough theory to me why, why, these, uh, why this has been a successful um, business model, I guess.
has a um, not not overly bright, but I would say definitely on the brighter side tone. The the touch is really nice. I feel like I can I can manipulate it really well. Um, feels good. So come check it out. See what you think. If you're watching this uh, locally, then that that should be easy to do. But if you're watching out of state, then uh, just know that we can we've we've shipped pianos all over the country, and it's it's actually a pretty easy proposition to to ship such a large and relatively fragile uh, instrument a thousand miles or more. The uh, address here is 1497 South State Street and the uh, 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 website is BrighamLarsonPianos.com.